Welcome back to Scribble Knots Unmasked, Burning Dog fans. Oh man, I haven't made an episode of this since uh, last July, actually. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest, it had been so long since I played this game as a side thing, as opposed to uh, The Binding of Isaac or Rogue Legacy, that I actually kind of forgot about it for a while. Until somebody left a comment on one of the old episodes asking for confirmation that I had abandoned it and wasn't planning to go back. Oops! Well, let's rectify that situation, shall we? I had to look into it, but last time we saved a uh, stately Wayne Manor from an attack by Rachel Ghoul. Ooh, that's a lot of uh, Batman points. These, of course, are the secret origins, in case you'd forgotten. Let's spend some space points and take a look at Green Lantern's origin story. Got a blast from the past going to start things off. That's why I bought it! The Green Lantern, who he is and how he came to be. My father was a test pilot. He died when I was still very young. As long as I can remember, I always wanted to fly. N? Yes, N! <laughs> One day, Abin Sur, the Green Lantern of Space Sector 2814, had crashed in the desert. The Green Lantern Corps act as an interstellar police force. He told me that I was chosen to be the next Green Lantern because I could overcome fear. And with this ring, not only could I fly, but construct anything I will. Recently, the universe is attacked by the Black Lanterns. We are a group of reanimated corpses led by the Black Hand. They sought to eliminate all life. The only thing that could stop them was to combine all the Corps' powers. That meant everyone joined in, even the Green Lantern's arch-rivals, the Sinestro Corps. I thought that was very clever. Uh, something scary. Yeah, fuck you, bear! What makes people afraid? Hmm. The Star Sapphires, including my girlfriend Car Carol Ferris, also joined. Star Sapphires are powered by love. Great something that reminds people of love. The Red Lantern Corps. Red led by the horrifying Atrocitus joined. The Red Lanterns are fueled by rage, great something that makes people angry. Um, there are so many really bad jokes I could make, but let's not go to any of them. Hmm, what makes people angry? Taxer? Nope. Ha 
<laughs> okay, okay. Uh, I forgot how fun it was to be this silly. But no, um. Man, what makes people angry? It's mostly concepts, right? Bad driver? No. Um. Hmm. All right. What did uh, this is just kind of a vague concept. What did you have in mind? Create a person that angers people. Okay, how about... Murderer? There we go. Nobody likes a murderer. The Blue Lantern Corps join... Uh, sorry, Corps. Damn it! I've been so good about that. The Blue Lantern Corps joins, uh, joins us. They were formed with the banished guardian Sade. The Blue Lanterns spread hope. Create something that gives people hope. Hmm. Darn. I didn't think that would actually work. No? I'm trying not to just put Superman. <laughs> On my world, it means hope. Oh, that didn't work. Uh, okay, what gives people hope? Hope for the future, hope for... Even Larf Lees, who was the sole living member of his Orange Lantern Corps, joined the battle. I believe he's uh, more commonly referred to as Agent Orange. The Orange Lantern Corps is powered by greed. Great something that everybody wants. Enormous money bag. Finally, the Indigo Tribe, which is founded by the same Abin Sur who gave me my ring, joined us. I believe their compassion. Yeah! <laughs> Fuck you guys! It was the toughest challenge the Corps has ever faced. Gosh, that sure does sound scary. It was, but it's over now. You know, Maxwell, since your power is a lot like mine, I bet you'd make a great Green Lantern. Thanks, Mr. Jordan! Achievement unlocked, meet Hal Jordan. Where to? Darn, let's earn some, uh... Wayne points, then, shall we? Back to Wayne Manor. Since we've been, uh, spent a lot of time in, uh, Gotham City. Ooh. These trees have to go! Oh shit, don't look over there. And may the fourth be with us. Alright. Bawana Beast. I don't know who that is. Mike Maxwell is a ranger in the wild of Africa. After drinking an and magical elixir, Mike gains the power to communicate with animals and merge them together to make a more formidable creature. 
That's kind of fucked up. With the help of a gorilla named Juba, he fights crime as the superhero Bawana Beast. He's also Freedom Beast. While in danger, Dominic Mun... I don't... I'm sorry, I don't know how to say that. Ndawe was rescued by Animal Man and Bawana Beast. He was given some of the elixir used by Bawana and told he should take over as South Africa's defender. Now known as Freedom Beast, Dominic has the ability to control the minds of animals he fuses together and has super strength, speed, and agility. I turned up the music because it was really quiet on the title screen, but it does tend to be really loud everywhere else. I mean, look how low I have to turn everything. Feast upon them! Oh. Yeah, sure, that works. Eh. Eh. Why is it turning green like that? Oh, I think it's getting health from, uh. Ah! Flee! That's a good thing Bawana Beast was there. Just wanted to see if he would fuse the rhino with a cow, but I guess it's not very helpful. Who might you be? Elasti Woman. Rita Farr was a Hollywood actress for an accident exposure to strange volcanic gases. She now has the ability to shrink or expand her body at will. Her Hollywood career over, she is recruited into the Doom Patrol as the superheroine known as Elasti Woman. By arranging fake accidents that ruined the lives of several superpowered people, Mad scientist Niles Calder created a team consisting of Robot Man, Elastigirl, Mento, Negative Man, and Bumblebee. Unaware that Niles had caused their accidents, the Doom Patrol goes on suicidal missions to save the world. That's kind of fucked up. Actually, that's really fucked up. Robot Man. Due to sustained injuries, Robert Crane's body is transplant uh, brain is transplanted into a powerful metallic body to become the first Robot Man. Robot Man is a member of the All-Star Squadron. Yeah, this one sounds like the one they meant. The victim of an accident that destroyed his body, Clifford Steele's brain, is transplanted into a metallic bo uh, body to become the second version of Robot Man. He is a member of the Doom Patrol. El Muerto. Formerly a fan of Superman, Pablo Valdez was uh, de defeated in a failed rescue attempt. Brought back to life, and uh, angry that Superman- oh, okay. I get it. He was killed in a failed rescue attempt. They just said defeated because it's a children's game. Uh, angry, brought back to life and angry that Superman did not help him, Pablo became El Muerto and fought crime in Mexico where he teamed up and reconciled with the Man of Steel. Oh, I know everyone knows who Superman is. No. Oh. Brother to the first electrocutioner, Lester Baczynski donned the name and suit that grants him electric powers to commit crimes and inevitably ring him against two heroes such as Batman and Nightwing. Wow, that kind of tells you how much the guy from uh, Arkham Origins sucked that he didn't even get a listing. Okay, which one are you? Just regular Wonder Woman or someone, one of the other Wonder Womans? Wonder Women? Woman Woman. Great. This is what happens when I type without paying attention. Uh, Earth 2, it sounds like a, uh, a, uh... Not your normal Wonder Woman achievement unlocked. Earth 2 Wonder Woman. A former member of the All-Star Squadron, this Earth's Wonder Woman was the secretary for the Justice Society and worked under the name Diana Prince at the U.S. War Department. I remember reading about that! Uh... On the one hand, it was really progressive for the Justice Society to have a female member at all, but then they just uh, made Wonder Woman the secretary who stayed behind and only occasionally went on missions. Arr. 
Berg? That's really weird. Have I not summoned any of the other ones? Oh, uh, summon a different Batman. This one. No, no, that worked. Oh, okay. Needs you over there, Terry. Whoa, awesome. Conservative is stranded. happened? Hater is gonna hate? Also got another achievement. Gotham Baller. Get 3,000 amount of Gotham reputation. Sort of curiosity. No, I guess I've done that before. Help dilute this peanut butter so I can clean it. Water? Mm. I can't fly up there on his back. As fun as that would be. Oh man! Ha! Huh. They're all called herbivore because that's what they called the original one. Also, I remembered why it was changing colors. Because in this game, items have durability, and it, uh, instead of showing the durability, you know, it had it in Scribble Knots Unlimited too, but instead of showing the durability in the form of little hearts like it does with the character's health, they just change color and get gradually, uh, go from green to red. Ah! Great. Well, that's appropriate. Ah! Why did it fall asleep? Why can't I hit them? Awesome. Okay, hello, Lagoon Boy. to work.
Why aren't you attacking them? Uh, that's not working anyway. Joker's Funhouse. Oh, I guess we're going there in the next episode of, uh, Scribble Knots Unmasked. I'm going to be doing three today. Uh, because... You remember in the most recent, uh... Well, if you remember, in the most recent, uh, session of Dishonored, where I beat the game, I complained that, uh... That problem with, with uh, YouTube and the uploads taking forever, how that was still in effect. Well, it turns out that was the day YouTube decided to uh, get its shit in gear and uh, correct things. So, you know, knock on wood, uh, uploads have been taking a reasonable amount of time again, like 20 minutes per. And, uh... Of course it would have to be that one, right? So I'm going to be uh, doing that, partially because, you know, I haven't done this in forever and I just wanted to uh, make up for it a bit. Partially because I, uh, you know, partially because I can, I can get away with doing that and not have to upload videos all night long. And partially because, honestly, <laughs> because I left off at 17 videos and leaving off in an odd number just itches at me. <laughs> Yeah, three today, two tomorrow. So, I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'll see you on the next Scribble Knots Unmasked. Later!